Hello again. Uh, those of you who have joined me in the past for these recorded meditations, and if you're new, welcome. Uh, my name is Jenny, and um, today I'll be leading uh, an example of a calming meditation, just something if you, uh, maybe some practices that might help you to bring a little bit more ease to the body and mind um, if you're a little bit stressed out, uh, or just to practice, we can practice these techniques, um, some of them even in everyday life too. So hopefully I'll introduce something that works for you. Um, I will be uh, ringing a bell to initiate this meditation, but I'm not gonna ring one at the end. I'm gonna let you decide how long you wanna continue this practice. So I will give instructions up to a point and then I'll tell you when I'm signing off, but then it'll be up to you to decide how long uh, you want to keep practicing because in the time period that I allocate, it may not be enough for you to get your mind to calm down, but hopefully some of these techniques will be helpful. So with that introduction, uh, we'll begin. So just settle into your meditation posture, some, play, some way of sitting or lying down or standing that you feel comfortable and grounded, yet upright and alert, but also relaxed. So taking your posture, I'll ring the bell to transition us in. So with the fading of the sound of the bell, it tells us we're transitioning into a meditation practice. And we can begin just by noticing how the mind and the body are right now. So how is the mind? Is it calm or is it agitated? Is it kind of curious, alert, or is it going to sleep? Not judging it, just noticing how it is right now. And then noticing how the body is. Is it relaxed or is there some tension, some feeling of restlessness? maybe a lack of energy and feeling like the body's collapsing, just how is it right now? Not judging, just noticing bodies like this. And so we're starting to pay attention to how the mind and the body are, and that's the core of our practice. Just noticing how it is, not judging, just noticing how it is right now, and then inviting things that may help to greater ease in the body and the mind. So we do this through our meditation practices. And for this practice, I suggest that we set an intention to not follow our thoughts as we normally do, not follow the agitation of the body, but just incline the mind towards calm, incline the body towards calm, and also inclining towards awareness of calm in the mind and body. So we can, if we haven't already, close our eyes. that groundingness, a sense of connection that, and support that can allow us to feel at ease, knowing that we're supported. And we can just notice sensations in the body, just noticing how the body is right now. The body resting is like this, and the mind resting in the body is like this. Just noticing how the mind and body are. Not judging, just noticing it's like this. Mm -hmm. 
And one practice we can use to calm the mind and body is taking three intentional breaths, just a normal inhalation, but a slightly longer exhale than normal breathing. So you can just breathe in. And then when you're breathing out, just make the exhalation slightly longer than the inhale. And then breathing back in again, a slightly longer exhale. One more in breath and then slightly longer exhale. And then resuming normal breathing. And checking in again with the mind and the body. How is it now? And in our practice of meditation, we usually choose a meditation object to give the mind something to do rather than wandering off and thinking. And I suggest that you pay attention to wherever in the body feels like they're ease or calm right now. A lot of people choose the breath just because the rhythm of the breath, the inhale, the exhale is calming that rhythm. But if the breath isn't easy for you, isn't calming, then maybe notice the hands resting, just the support of the hands on the legs or on whatever you're sitting on, or maybe the feet being supported by the, the ground, feeling that connectedness, maybe that feels calming. So place the awareness there, set the intention to stay Noticing calming sensation in the body, the hands, the feet, or the breath, the rhythm of the breath. Setting the intention for the mind to stay there, to rest there, not following thoughts, just being present with the body, the breath is like this. And checking in with the mind to see if it's still Resting in awareness of this place in the body that's at ease, or if it's gone off thinking, analyzing, gone to sleep. Not judging it, just noticing where the mind's gone. What effect that has on the mind. And then coming, checking in with the body, coming back to our place of ease. Returning our attention back to this place. Noticing where the mind is, if it's still with our place of ease in the body or if it's wandered off. Just noticing if there's restlessness or agitation in the mind or the body at any time. And we can just observe, notice that restlessness. Just noticing the sensation of the feeling of it rather than buying into the story of it. Noticing restlessness feels like this. And then returning to our place of ease. Groundedness, the breath. The mind resting in this place of ease. Observing.
Noticing where the mind is, how the mind is, how the body is. Noticing what leads to calm in the mind and the body and what causes agitation when we buy into stories, get into patterns of thinking or restlessness and just letting that go. And we just keep returning, noticing the place of calm, the groundedness, the rhythm of the breath. And we do this over and over again, inviting the mind to observe the places of ease in the body. Where is the mind? How is the mind? How is the body? Observing what leads to ease, what leads to agitation. Inviting ease, inviting noticing ease. And we keep practicing like this. And I'm not gonna give any more instruction, but you can keep practicing like this for as long as you like. Noticing if agitation arises, but just observing it, not buying into it. Returning again and again to the body groundedness, the rhythm of the breath, whatever in our body allows the mind and body to be at ease. Keep practicing for as long as you like. 